What's up? What's up, YouTube? My voice is a little messed up today. I don't know what happened Saturday. It went out and it ain't come back yet. But anyway, I wanted to make a really quick video here this morning. It just a thought hit me. Um, I just walked out of the post office and uh, <clears throat> I think we've dropped off in the last two days about 22 or 2300 EDVMs. That's every door direct mail. And so I just wanted to give you a rundown of EDVM versus, uh, say, clip flyers or door hangers. Um, so a door hanger or clip flyer, you're going through a neighborhood that you can drive through. It's not gated. Even if they got signs up, no soliciting, you can still throw clip flyers. You can still do every door. I mean, uh, still do door hangers. Um, you can still talk to people one on one. So me personally, and this may change as, as our company grows, but as of right now in my location, EDDMs are great for gated communities. Communities that I can't go in and just clip fly a whole neighborhood. Even though we're in a gated community almost every day of the week, most of them you can't put yard signs out. Most of them you can do a five round to give a little, uh, it's not really soliciting. You're not really giving them the card asking for their business. I'm basically doing a five round, knocking on doors, letting the neighbors know we're going to be pressure washing and we're going to make a little noise. Um, you're going to smell our detergents, our soaps, and we just want to let you know we're here and, uh, and this is what the noise is. <clears throat> so that's a pretty cool deal to get a five round in a gated community, but you can't clip flyer. You can't leave a yard sign. So what I have found that works great for us is that's where we focus our EDDMs on. I want to hit EDDMs in neighborhoods in my local area. If it's sixty thousand to seventy-five thousand dollar annual income on the post office's revenue line, that's the neighborhoods we're doing EDDMs at. Any other neighborhood, I'm clip flyer in the neighborhood. So that's just food for thought for you guys. Um, man, if you got gated communities, man, blow it up with an EDDM. Don't try to clip flyer. Don't try to get kicked out. Just use the EDDM for the neighborhoods that are substantially uh, higher paying neighborhoods with three to four hundred thousand dollar homes in them, um, six hundred to a million dollar home. Um, those are the neighborhoods that I'm personally. Um, spending my money to do EDDMs on. So hopefully that helped you. Hopefully that gave you some thought. I'm backing out the post office now. I don't want to hit nobody. But uh, definitely, man, let us know what you think of our videos. Let, you know, comment below. If you've got a technique that works different than what I just said, man, I'm learning too. I'm learning from all the other guys. And so if you've got something that works, um, man, comment below. Let us know what it is because we're all in this together. You know, just trying to carve out a lane of, of the service industry in the cleaning. And so we need to help each other. Anything you got to help me, I'll sure take your advice. Thanks. Y'all have a great day. See ya.